Good Thursday morning, everybody. Chris Allen with your weather podcast for this October 22nd. Hope that you had a great uh, Wednesday. We're now into Thursday, and uh, we're getting closer to the weekend and getting closer to rain chances uh, showing back up on the radar. Well, not the radar, but kind of the radar as we're looking down the road there. Uh, Yesterday, we had a high of 78. It was a warm and sunny day across southern Kentucky. 78 was the high. That happened a little bit after 3 p.m. at the Bowling Green Airport. 70 is the average high, so we were 8 degrees above average. Our low was 42 yesterday morning. 45 is the average low, so we were 3 degrees below average. One year ago, back in 2014, we had a high of 69 and a low of 42. No rainfall past 24 hours, but we do see some rain on the horizon. In fact, we're going to move into a cooler, more unsettled weather pattern as we get into the weekend and the beginning of uh, even next week, the last week of October, and uh, heading into Halloween, which is next Saturday. Looking mostly sunny, warm again today. We're going to be running about 10 degrees above average today if we hit our predicted high of 80 degrees. For tonight, mainly clear, continued mild, a low of 51. For Friday, much of the day will be dry, but as a cold front approaches from the west, we will see an increase in cloud cover. It will remain warm with a high of 81 expected on Friday afternoon. It is into Friday evening. We're looking for a chance of showers, perhaps even a thunderstorm just to the west of us. So if you're going out for Friday night football tomorrow night, there could be a few showers in the area and a low of 59. The better chance of rain now appears to be on Saturday. We're going to have a Uh, Sort of a slow-moving frontal boundary that's going to move in. An area of low pressure is going to develop over Texas. Lots of tropical moisture coming in with this next system. And uh, it appears uh, we're going to see some decent rainfall on Saturday. Now, uh, the chance of rain, 70%. A few thunderstorms are also in there. Breezy, too. Southwest winds at 12 to uh, maybe 20 miles per hour. We'll see a high of 72 for Saturday afternoon. Showers continue Saturday night with a low of 60, and we're going to keep in about a 40% chance of showers, otherwise cloudy on Sunday with a cooler high of 68. But we get a a little bit of a break now between System 1 and System 2. System 2 is going to come in by Tuesday of next week, so for Monday we're going to say A mix of sun and clouds and a high around 70. But Tuesday, here we go again, 40% chance of showers and maybe some thunderstorms with the next low-pressure system. And this one uh, could produce even more rainfall than the uh, the system coming in on Saturday. 68 will be the high. But then heavy rain potential coming in for Tuesday night and all during the day next Wednesday – 70% chance already, uh, the rain chance for next Wednesday. Showers and thunderstorms likely, maybe some heavy rainfall. We may have to keep an eye on flood potential here. Flash flooding is a possibility. This is uh, tapping into some deep, deep moisture, tropical moisture from uh, uh, a, uh, uh, what's her name, Priscilla? I don't don't know. I was looking at uh, some of the... um, uh, National Hurricane Center stuff. Patricia. Yeah, it's in the Eastern Pacific. Uh, while we don't have anything really going on in the Atlantic, uh, there is a system that is off the Baja of California, uh, Hurricane Patricia, which uh, looks like it's going to become a major hurricane for the Baja, and then it's going to curve back into Old Mexico. Well, actually, it's south of Baja, It's going to move over Old Mexico, uh, go across, it looks like, Mexico City, and then move into southern Texas, and that is going to uh, really produce uh, copious amounts of rainfall. 
And so we're going to get remnants of that system coming in for the middle of next week. Actually, it's going to be a player even on Saturday's weather indirectly, but more directly so by the middle of next week. So we're going to go ahead and uh, do kind of a heads up here that we could be looking at some very heavy rainfall on the order of maybe uh, two to three inches or more as we get into the middle of next week. And uh, high temperatures will then stay cool uh, in the 60s, possibly even upper 50s by the time that system moves away. So looks like a rainy Saturday, part of Sunday, and then really rainy by, uh, say, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday of next week. All right, that'll do it for this edition of the podcast. God bless as always, and thank you so much for listening. Know the weather before it knows you. Have a great day. I'll see you live at 5.30 on AM Kentucky, 11 o'clock on midday, streaming live to the WBKO app and to WBKO.com. Later this afternoon, between 3 and 7, classic hits, Sam 100.7 and the Chris Allen Radio Show.